Today I'm going to share with you why baitcaster backlashes happen. When you cast your baitcaster, the second that lure leaves your rod tip, your spool starts letting off line at an incredible rate of speed. As your lure starts to get resistance from the wind and loses momentum altogether when it hits the water, but your spool continues to let off line and since it has nowhere to go, it starts to fluff up and in some cases causes that dreaded backlash bird's nest, rat nest, hell on earth. A lot of anglers don't know that their baitcaster has two built-in braking systems that help with backlash. They either have centrifugal brakes or magnetic brakes. These are designed to help slow down your spool in the first 70% of your cast. And there's also a spool tension knob designed to slow down your spool in the last 30% of your cast. These are safety net braking systems that allow you to train or educate your thumb over time to do what your built-in braking systems did for you when you started out. Want to learn more on how to effectively use your baitcaster to land more fish? Hit that sub and I'll keep them coming.